Welcome to Hydropower. Today we will solve one numerical problem related to masking equation. Um, the question is given as route the following flawed hydrograph through a river ridge for which masking coefficient k equals 10 r and x equals 0.2 at the start of inflow and flood. The outflow discharges 10 cubic meter per second. With a tabular value is given as time at the interval of 6 hours and the inflow is each 6 hour inflow is given here. Now let's go to its solution. First we will have uh, the given data where k equals 10 hour, x equals 0 0.2 and delta equals 6 hour. Now uh, using the masking equation we will calculate the value of each. If you would like to have detail about the masking equation you can watch our previous video uh, if you can find the previous video you can click on the i button displayed on this video on uh, at the top of this video now let's continue to our video the formula of the masking equation are this one where q2 equals c0 i2 plus c1 i1 plus c2 q1 where c, c0 c1 and c2 are given here with and after calculating the c0 c1 and c2 you have to Calculate that C0 plus C1 plus C2 equals 1, which which results should be 1. Uh, now calculating the value of C0, C1 and C2, we will get the C0, C1 and C2 as 0 0.09, 0 0.45 and 0 0.45 respectively. Uh, the C0 self, the, uh, you have to place the value of K, X and delta on this C0, C1 respective formula and you will get this value on calculating. After calculating this value, you have to check the value of C1 plus C1 plus C2 equals 1. Here, the equation satisfies our condition. Now, let's move to the next one. Uh, C0 I1 shall be calculated here. Now, we have already calculated the value of C0 as it is uh, 0 0.0909 and I2 shall be taken from the inflow. The second inflow that is 27 should be taken for the calculation of this value and similarly for the c1 i1 uh, we have already calculated the value of c1 that's 0 0.4545 and i2 should be for shall be 14 now on multiplying this c1 and i1 will get, get the value of 6.3 and for the calculation of c2 q1 we have to know the value of q2 as we have already given in the question that discharge or let's say the outflow is 10 and this will be considered as the q2 is considered as the q2 and the value of c2 is already calculated from the previous formula that is 0 0.4545 on multiplying c2 and q2 we'll get the c2 q1 will get the new value on the same process we have to calculate the next value for the 2 value 18 and so on and we'll get the final result now this was for today and we will come again with a new video till then keep on watching our videos and don't forget to subscribe thank you